Yeah, it hurt him a lot. I see it in his eyes, it hurt him a lot. The shooting of this young man has triggered now a response that has been building. Days ago of a young unarmed black man who was supposed to head off to college this week. The verdict is, what do you, what do you mean he's not being indicted. So I already know. On November 24th, many gathered in Union Square Park awaiting the verdict of Darren Wilson. Wilson killed an unarmed teen, Michael Brown, after an altercation took place at the officer's car. I think I'm here just like everybody else. I think we want justice, and not only justice for this particular situation, Mike Brown's death, but just justice for every person who's been killed by police brutality, killed by this capitalist system. Um, everything across the board, I think we're all here for the same reason, that we all want justice, and if we don't get it now, we're gonna definitely get it. We're here um, as Filipinos because we are in solidarity with uh, the people of Ferguson, and we as Filipinos will not tolerate uh, the system's war, on systemic war on black people, on our black sisters and brothers. I mean, we've been going through this since day one. To me, this is the, uh, this is slavery all over again. It has never left, you know? This is supposed to be a country that's supposed to be there for all of us. The police are supposed to be there to protect us, but instead of protecting us, they're controlling us. They're there for the corporations, they're there for the powers that be, they're there for the 1%, but they're not there for the people. And you know what, granted, there are a lot of good police officers, okay? My brother, he's a police officer, but the bottom line is, even if you're a good police officer, with a police officer and you do nothing, then you're just as bad. The people gathering hoped for justice but were crushed when the grand jury decided not to incite Darren Wilson for the murder of Michael Brown. It has led to a larger gap in the way that black people interact with authority figures in uh, the political realm. Um, with police authorities and um, who makes the laws or controls the laws. There has traditionally been a rift in between, you know, the black community and that other side of authority um, due to the history of this country. So I feel like now it's widened even more because you have a population of youth who do not understand why these things are going on. I'm tired of apologizing for my blackness, for wearing his skin in fractions and hope that white America look, could look past that part. Call me black man before angry black man. Let myself become content with treating life like a full quarter comeback. Trey got shot for walking on the wrong side of a Florida night. His killer still walks on this side of the free world. Mike caught a six pack outside of St. Louis. His killer is now being paid to chug a beer from his couch and watch the protests on the news.